Hey guys, welcome back to another mini -sode. 1999 was a really great year for video games. We had the release of the Sega Dreamcast. The Nintendo 64 had some good releases like Mario Party, Donkey Kong 64, and Pokemon Stadium. And the PlayStation was going strong with Silent Hill, Final Fantasy VIII, and Resident Evil 3. But there was also another big game on PlayStation 1 that year, one that took gamers by surprise and started an incredibly popular franchise. A little extreme sports game called Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. With its fun gameplay, easy to learn controls, and awesome graphics and soundtrack, THPS became a best-selling and critically acclaimed game that only got better when the sequel was released a year later to not only more glowing reviews, but being listed as one of the greatest games of all time. Of course, a third installment was on the way, and it was going to be on all consoles, like the previous two, including Sony's new PlayStation 2, as well as the Big Green. However, due to probably Sony having an exclusive time period, Part 3 wouldn't hit Xbox until 2002, a year after being on PS2. So to pass the time and not leave big green owners without a Tony Hawk game, Activision released Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2X, a sort of HD remake of the first two games as a launch title. So how does this remix handle? Let's find out. For those who have never picked up a Hawk game, THPS in general is a skateboarding game, where the style is more arcade in nature, with the objective being to score points by performing tricks in the stage. These range from grinds, flips and aerials, to name a few. The more tricks you successfully pull off, the bigger your score combo gets, netting you the points if you pull off the landing, and of course losing it all in a blaze of fail if you fall. The main part of Pro Skater is the career mode, and there are three career modes in 2X. The careers from the first two games and a third exclusive to 2X. In career mode, you must complete certain objectives in order to advance to the next stage. These consist of getting a high score, collecting letters to spell the word skate, pulling off a particular trick on certain objects. Hell, there are even competitions where you must get in the top three places to win. Completing these nets you not only new stages to skate on, but also new boards, characters, and skill points to up your chosen skater's attributes. Now when they say that this is the definitive versions of Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 and 2 combined, they mean it, as all stages, characters, and modes make an appearance here, along with five new stages exclusive to this version. Even the skate park editor makes a return. They also threw in some new changes from Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3, like female creative skaters, a better balance meter for grinding, and of course graphical improvements thanks to the power of the big green. And of course, who can forget the amazing soundtracks? They too make a comeback. Well, the soundtrack of Part 2 does, so you're not going to find Superman here. But then again, you could just rip the music to your hard drive and listen to it that way. Of course, I wish I could play the music for you here, but, you know, YouTube, copyright infringement and all that fun stuff. Sadly, 2X doesn't have online play like Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3 did, as Xbox Live wasn't ready yet. So, instead, the multiplayer consisted of a few modes for up to four players, either on split screen or system link, like graffiti, trick attack, horse, and tag. As far as any flaws I'd have with 2X, I really don't have any to speak of as what you see is what you get. A high definition remake of the first two Tony Hawk games with some extra stuff thrown in the pot. The controller may throw you off if you've been using a DualShock all these years, but other than that, this is a really good director's cut of two of the best skateboarding games ever made, and quite affordable too. Now of course, Xbox owners would get Part 3 the following year, and again without online play, with the next installments being on all systems at the same time from here on out. So we've got a few to go through, but for now, I think I'll call it here. So as always, this is the Dolly Popka saying, stay green everybody. See you next time.